That's right. As folks start dropping their ballots off here over the next couple of weeks in Linwood, they will have a choice between two candidates, one hoping to make history here in the state of Washington, the other hoping hers repeats here in Linwood. The city of Linwood is at a crossroads. Massive growth fueled by the new light rail and city center projects have Linwood looking to the future and who will lead it there. We'll start here and just work our way around. Josh Bindup is a fresh face to city politics. The 21 year old UW Bothell political science major is the son of Liberian immigrants who literally won a lottery to be able to come to America. Binda made a name for himself as an activist during the George Floyd protest last year. If voters approve, he would be the youngest African American ever elected to public office in the state of Washington. To me, it means that like I'm being someone that can be a catalyst for the younger generation to get involved. I was actually on the council when when Joshua was born. Lisa Utter is a no-nonsense political veteran, having previously served on the Linwood City Council from 1998 to 2009. She raised the family here and helped pave the way for the light rail and surrounding development. As she walks the campaign trail with a constituent, Utter says her deep roots in the community set her apart. I'm the chair of the cold weather shelter and I've been a volunteer at all the schools and I've, you know, worked on the Friends of the Library and so I have, you know, a lot of, of connections. Increasing affordable housing and encouraging diversity in the city are the top two issues for each candidate who are very similar on paper, if nothing else. The campaign, a matter of personality and perspective, as Linwood writes its next chapter in the history books. I think I bring a lot of experience and a lot of um, knowledge. I'm sure she accomplished great things, but I just think we're, we're ready to move in a different direction here in Linwood. Binda and Utter are both running for position three on the council here in Linwood. And remember to get your ballots in by November 2nd. Live in Linwood tonight, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.